name's uh, Mike Daniels and I'm a local parts member and I'm the Rainy McFords uh, District Secretary. I'm out today in Rochford campaigning, uh, as you can see, education, not segregation. This is to do with the Conservatives' plan for grammar schools, or the reintroduction of grammar schools. The Tory government are making it a, uh, a way of segregating people. They haven't set out a plan of how they would introduce these grammar schools. Would they take over schools such as King Edmunds and say to uh, students you're no longer allowed to study in King Edmunds unless you pass a, a, a test like 11 plus? Or are they going to build new grammar schools? Now, Watchford's district uh, need more schools built, comprehensive. Uh, there's not enough of them anyway. So are they just going to build new grammar schools? Well, this is completely wrong. Why should we uh, go against the grammar schools that the Tories impose? Well, I believe that children, all children, should be given the chance to have a decent education, a uh, comprehensive education, uh, because I believe that children um, can succeed uh, in adults um, having uh, a type of education that they uh, believe in. I'm Ashley Dalton and I'm here um, in Rochford today on our Education Not Segregation campaign. Um, the Labour Party um, opposing Tory plans um, to change legislation to allow new grammar schools or existing grammar schools to grow. Um, in South End we've got four uh, existing grammar schools um, and if they already there aren't enough places for um, indecent comprehensives in South End for all of our children. Um, comprehensives in South End on Sea right now are being asked to expand their intake year on year because there simply aren't enough places for children um, in the local area. And in the meantime, our grammar schools, some of them have got up to as little as 25% of their pupils coming from the local area. So the idea that grammar schools are for local children is, is something of a myth. Um, and what we don't want to see is even more grammar schools, putting even more pressure um, on places for all children to have an outstanding education in Southend.